Hello and welcome to a narrated video tour for 34 Hammonds Plains Road, Suite 434 in Bedford, Nova Scotia. This condo corporation is known as Piers Landing. So this is made up of several buildings that you can see here. Okay, so I'm just at the entrance of the, of the parking lot that uh, is for all the units. And I'm just going to do a quick 360 here because this is Hammonds Plains Road, but it's right at the beginning. So that's the Bedford Basin right there. So you've got shopping, entertainment, uh, board, the Bedford Boardwalk is just down there, Wolf Park, schools, trails, uh, nature walks, everything in the area, easy walking distance actually. Uh, there's actually a grocery store, gas station, uh, pharmacy, everything. And then also just around the corner, if you just go up here, you go up there and then you take a left, then you have Paper Mill Lake. And that's great for swimming and everything in the summer. So you're right smack dab in the middle of Bedford and it's just a great area. You also have highway access just up the street there and you also have public transit all around you as well. So as you can tell, Hammonds Plains Road is a main thoroughfare, but again, you're not very far up Hammonds Plains Road because that's Bedford Highway. All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to walk around the exterior of this property first, the Condo Corporation. I'm going to show you where the visitor parking is, where the garbage is, uh, where the parking spot for this unit is. It's an assigned parking spot. And the reason why I do it this way is so then you can get a true understanding of what it would be like to live here. You know, how many steps it takes to get from one place to another. And I'll also show you the building amenities, uh, which is um, basically the pool and whatnot. So what we have here is, again, so there's your entrance. That's where I've just walked down. And you have some visitor parking here. All along here, there's my truck just parked up there. And we, you can see the sign for visitor parking. Okay, so a good amount of visitor parking. And the parking spot for this unit is actually great. It's directly in front of the building, which is fantastic. Because as you can see, it's a pretty big parking area. So you've got all this here, and then your parking kind of goes down the street and goes left and right. So I'll be showing you that in a moment. This is the garbage recycling and uh, compost area so you would just walk out your front door which we will in a moment just down there and you come up here and you put it in the designated spot so you can see your garbage in the bin there this is for compost and then your different types of recycling here so very close not that far of a walk at all I'll just close that up all right now we'll continue to walk down so it does have a pool that everyone here can use, but of course it's we're very close to the snow falling now, so the pool is closed down. But I will show it to you, I'm just gonna lean over the fence. So this is so very so uh, all of the addresses you saw when we first walked in are for the different buildings. So our building is just right here, number 34. It's coming behind me, there we go. All right. So I'll show you the pool first. I'm just going to lean over the gate. Let's see, I can probably do it right here. So there's the pool right there. So again, it's all shut down for the winter time. And there's Bedford Basin. You can see it peeking out there. So you can see fireworks at different times of the year. I mean, it's just a great area and you have coffee shops around you all within walking distance. So this pool, of course, will be all cleaned up and ready to go uh, during the summer months. So that's a great perk. And then you also have a little outside fire pit just over there. So those are for some of the amenities of this condo corporation that everybody gets to use. Okay, so again, there's the front entrance to our building. And we are parking spot number 53, which is right here. So that is amazing. So there's 53. So there's your outside parking spot that is assigned to this condo. And there's your entrance right there. So you don't have a very far walk like the folks up there or over here or down over here. You're literally right in front of the building, which is great. So let's just this. All right, so that's the outside of the condo. And we are number, um, we're right on the, on the top floor. So that's our balcony right there. So you have a beautiful view of Bedford Basin which is amazing. So let's go on up there. So to get in the security doors, you have a special key. Looks like that. So this is what the foyer looks like. There's the security system in your intercom. 
Just gonna take our security key. There we go. And we're good to go. <laughs> Trying to open and close doors with one hand. Can be tricky. All right, so these are your mailboxes tucked in under the stairs. So there you go, a little community bulletin board as well. Now we'll just walk up a few flights of stairs. entrance there. There's the door we came in. <coughs> Excuse me, I'm just getting a bit of getting over a bit of a cold. All right, so here we are. So four, three, four. This is what it looks like. Nice and bright and open. One thing that I should also mention is a lot of the buildings here are much older, like in this condo corporation. So this is one of the youngest buildings and it's just over 10 years old. So everything's in great shape. So I'll back right up. So there's the entrance to the condo itself. Nice big walk-in closet here, coats and shoes and storage, lots of storage. I'm on a, looks, <laughs> pardon me, just have to catch my breath. I'm on a rolled floor, so a linoleum floor. This is your eating area. Really nice uh, wallpaper there. Beautiful kitchen with all the appliances. This uh, hallway goes down to your bedrooms and also your laundry and your uh, bathroom. And then this opens up into your, uh, your living room area and there's your deck outside. So let's start opening some doors for you. Here we go. So there's your walk-in closet. Nice flooring goes all the way through. And you've got shelves and organizers here. Nice big shelf there. And there's a rail. So a really nice size walk-in closet for a condo of this size. It's great. And it's electric heat, and you can see the, um, the uh, intelligent thermostats there on the wall. All right. So I'll just back up here. So there's your eating area. We'll go into the kitchen. So there's your fridge, your stove, rain shed unit just above and your built-in dishwasher and your untermounted stainless sink, stainless steel sink. There's your uppers. Goes all the way around. Let's back up a little bit. There we go. And there's your lowers. Looks to be a maple kitchen, maplewood kitchen, which is really pretty. Go right over to the corner here. And that's where we just came in. And you actually have a peekaboo area right here in the kitchen so you can see into your dining room and of course if you go this way you can see into the bedrooms as well really nice nice neutral paint color throughout as well all right so let's go into the living room so we're going from that rolled floor to a carpet it's just been freshly cleaned all the windows are vinyl Some nice big sliding glass door as well so there's your outside patio there you can see some of the commerce down there. So there's the grocery store, gas station, liquor store, everything that you need, um, coffee shops, all that good stuff. And then DeWolf Park is right there. And there's lots of parades that happen, different function, different events, and there's a boardwalk as well down there, the uh, Bedford, uh, Bedford Boardwalk, which is beautiful. So I'll just turn around. So here's your living room area. So you should be able to fit any type of furniture that you would like. Big screen TVs, big sectional couches like you have here right now. No problem at all. Nice and clean and bright. And we are on the top floor, so no one above us. Let's just go outside. And here we go. So you have a little sitting area set up right now. And there's your view of Bedford Basin, unobstructed. And there's the Bedford Highway, you can see right there. So that is the Atlantic Ocean, that is Bedford Basin. And there's our parking spot, number 53, where we were a moment ago. There's your pool, your fire pit. Walk back this way. There's the entrance. And uh, where we started a moment ago. All right, so that is great. Go back inside. Let's close the door now. All right, so let's continue on. When you're seeing these vents, that's for an air exchanger, which I'll be showing you in a moment, which is, again, uh, an example of how new the building is. So fresh air in, stale air out. 
a lot of older buildings, possibly like the other buildings here, some of the older old, older ones, will probably not have that. So again, another sort of upgraded feature of being newer than some of the other uh, condo corps in this area or the buildings associated with this condo corp. All right, as we get down to the end of the hallway, this is your master bedroom. This is your secondary bedroom, nice and bright. This is going to be your bathroom, so well-appointed bathroom. And then also, this is your electrical panel. So again, only a few years old, well-labeled, which is great. And then this is your telecom panel. That's where your internet and your modems and routers and all that good stuff, you can see it's fully wired, which is great. Again, another example of something that's newer. All right, so let's go into your secondary bedroom first. So we're still on that carpet that was just cleaned. We'll go right over to the window so you can see the view through this vinyl window. Similar view to your balcony, pool, Bedford Basin. Turn right around here. There's our closet, so a double bifold closet. We'll open that up in a moment. And that's where we were a moment ago. So let's pop this open for you. And there we go. So there's your shelf and rail across the top. And the carpet goes right in. Back up. And there's one of the thermostats, a close-up of one of the thermostats for the electric radiators. You can see right there. All right, we'll continue on now. Going into the master bedroom. Nice, good size room, great size room. We'll go right over to the window so you can see the view out of that. So if you look this way, so there's um, Hammonds Plains Road. And then we start to turn around and we'll have a similar view as we did from the other bedroom. Now we'll just turn all the way around. Great size room, no problem to fit a king size bed and furniture here. And you also have another um, double bifold closet. So let's open that up for you. There we go. There's your shelf and rail across the top. And the carpet, once again, goes right in. Close that up now. So really well-sized rooms, really a very, very nice condo. Now we'll turn the corner and we'll go see the bathroom. So we have a similar rolled floor that we did in the foyer when we first walked in. So there's your vanity, above mounted sink, more uh, looks like maple, it's similar to the kitchen. You also have a cabinet hanging on the wall there, which is great, almost a medicine cabinet. There's your mirror, your light, nice big mirror, and very nice and wide vanity here. There's your toilet, it's an elongated um, toilet, which is great. And there's your, your shower, acrylic shower, nice and easy and clean to maintain. You have a molded seat, so just, uh, you know, especially going into the winter months, come in and just close that uh, curtain and just sit there and let the hot water pour over your shoulders. After you, of course, you don't have to shovel the snow because it's a condo, but still, it's a, it's a really nice shower. All right, and then we will open up because you also have in-suite laundry, which is another perk. So there's the air exchanger. So fresh air in, stale air out. Here's your hot water tank, which is all good, uh, good to go here. And there's your stackable washer and your dryer. So in sweet laundry. So a full set of appliances. Let's close both the doors there. So there you go. So now you know everything about the condo, the amenities, where it's located, the floor plan. And I'll uh, put additional information in the write-up of the MLS listing with regards to the condo fees, uh, the dollar amount, and of course what's included. So thank you very much for watching. My name is Chris Ryan. I'm a um, Pardon me. I'm a realtor with Royal LePage Atlantic here in Halifax. If you have any questions or would like to schedule a showing, please reach out. My phone number is 902-830-4465. Thanks a lot. Have a great day. Bye-bye.